Hey everyone, it's uh, James here, and we've just hit the end of month eight. And uh, look, I can tell you without a shred of doubt that uh, I'm very happy with my results so far. It's um, I'm not even at full 12 months yet, I'm not even at 15 months for that matter, where you expect to see even further of a result. But uh, yeah, look, I'm end of month eight, and it's looking really goddamn good. Um, just give you a quick rundown. And the crown, of course. I think I got that. Um, yeah, just, it's absolute insanity. I'm amazed at the results that I've had so far. Still a little bit of thinness in this little spot here. But I mean, all in all, compared to what it was, <laughs> spiky, uh, geez, it's just like, I'm back to being my old confident self, which is, I mean, amazing. I don't know what else to say. Um, I will do a more in-depth uh, showing of what's going on up here, um, despite me doing my roundabout right now. And I'll leave that running while I speak right here. Uh, the clinic I went to was Hair of Istanbul and um, they treated me very well. They treated me with respect and I didn't feel like I was made fun of or mocked the whole time. And uh, that in itself, you know, little cherry on top of the amazing service that I had. I mean, I'm going to go into a full depth, proper review of the clinic uh, at some point but I can pass on this information confidently that Pair of Istanbul was the clinic I went to and I'm fucking goddamn happy with my results so far. Um, people might be skeptical of their clinic, Instagram being a lot of show, a lot of lights. Um, you know, I, I mean, I'm a small YouTuber. I don't get paid to do anything like this. I'm, I'm doing this purely on my days off. You know, I, I just finished work. I just got out of the shower. Um, you know, I, it looks like I've done my hair, but it's just because I didn't wash it. <laughs> I got lazy. Uh, but, I mean, their results that you see on Instagram, they're legit. And I was very dubious about it at first until I sought out other reviews that also did hair of Istanbul. Um, a, a lovely guy named Stephen with peanut butter on Instagram. Just a nice little shout out there. I touched base with him after seeing his original video on YouTube regarding hair of Istanbul got a bit of further insight as to whether they're a good clinic or not and uh yeah look i took a chance i did two years two years worth of research before i even made this choice mind you and uh you know i, I looked at canada mexico america the uk don't go to the uk they're not very good uh australia where i live absolute fraudulent place to get a hair transplant it's disgusting thailand you know some decent results there the second best place that i would have considered was a place in korea uh, south korea specifically I, I can't recall the name off the top of my head but they also have very 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 similar results i mean i, I feel like i paid i paid five thousand dollars usd for a result like this and again i will now show the before and after um I paid 5,000 USD for this, and it looks like a $40,000 job. It's insane, batshit crazy, and I'm fucking happy. Profanities aside, I'm goddamn happy. <laughs> and, uh, I mean, no scarring, nothing like that. I mean, I can even go around. Hopefully you can see that. Sorry for the mess. <laughs> but, uh, look, man, I'm happy. This is the end of month eight, and uh, I will go into a further in-depth analysis of a proper review, but I will be continuing this month to month until we hit month 12. And, uh, but I mean, I'm at month eight. It's the month leading up towards Christmas, and I look really fucking good. I look good, and I'm happy. Peace out.